Hey, it's Duke over here looking at this hideout. It's a 300 RLDS. I think that's rear living double slide. Now, this Rotoflex. See, there's rubber in here. And it says pivot head controls chucking. Well, if you've had a fifth wheel before, you know what chucking is. And this guy's the uh, three year structural warranty. That warranty is valid if you're, if you're living in the RV also. Full time use does not void the warranty on these Keystone products. Here is the uh, garage area with the uh, double welded aluminum down here. Uh, you can see underneath the subfloor. And this is where the there's a 30 gallon on each side propane tank. Sorry about that. There's some statistics there. If you like numbers? All right, so let's go ahead and take a look inside this one. It's a fifth wheel travel trailer. Hideout 300 RLDS. So this one is going to weigh uh, 9,300 pounds. If you need to know the hitch weight, let me know uh, the tongue weight. I'll get it for you. So I'm stepping up on the steps. So there's your entry door right there. There's a counter right there and some cabinet space. Just trying to let you see the layout here. So on, it's, it's opposing slides, double slide out. And it has the dinette, booth dinette, theater seating on one slide. The other slide has the kitchen and entertainment. And then you've got an island in the middle. And then the frame has got cross members right underneath where that island is. They designed these frames specifically this floor plan for each floor plan. This uh, floor is all one piece. There's no tongue and groove. There's no four by eights. That's what starts creaking and where you start getting soft floors because water works its way up through there. You get this double wide sofa in the back. So, uh, let's see. There's your theater seats. Directly across from your big screen TV. Electric fireplace. This has a 12 volt fridge. You want to see the freezer? That's where you can keep your pizzas before you stick them in there in the oven. Here's a cookie dough. Bring your cookie dough and pizza. You're going to eat healthy later. You could actually, when you're camping, the nice thing about camping in your own RV, you can just bring the groceries right from your kitchen. You eat, you eat oatmeal every morning. You have oatmeal in the campground. Put blueberries. I like blueberries, walnuts, cinnamon. And sometimes I'll put a little honey in there if I'm feeling like I want to get away with something. But usually, just walnuts and blueberries and cinnamon. Cinnamon is supposed to be good for you. Oatmeal is good for you. Alright, so, get back to the cooking show later. Here is the bathroom. Look before There's some controls there. Now, this is the bathroom. I think that winterization fluid from shipping was in the pipe. So, that's what that pink fluid is on the floor. And there is a uh, wardrobe over here. We can hang stuff up. A couple of drawers down there. Let me give you a shot of that from over here so you can see it. So that's at the foot of the bed. 